Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, or good night, whatever time it is, wherever you may be. I forgot to change my schedule graphic, so that was incorrect. I'm not speedrunning today, I'm playing Banjo-Kazooie, and hopefully finishing up this game, finally, after five weeks of actual gameplay, and about probably double that of uh, procrastinating. Doki, it's banjo time. Hopefully the last time I ever have to play this game and I can get rid of this graphic on this screen, never look back. It was great, thank you. Uh, I wish I could have snapped pics of the other trace matches, but it was a good, good time. Good, I'm glad to hear that, Nummies. We got exactly nowhere in our game, but it was still a blast. Hey man, sometimes that's the best. You're just fooling around too much, having having fun. Uh, are you guys able to hear this? Can you... Can, do you have audio? It's not showing up for me. You do, okay. Okay, as long as you can hear it. I don't see it on my end. Which is strange. Actually, let me... Real quickly, let's just hide it and bring it back. And there it is. Okay. Hello, caddy. Morning. Oh, no worries. No worries. Nummies, you're in Texas, right? You're in the grand old state of Texas? You're forsaken us. Alright, 794 notes. So I think you guys said I needed 810. And I think you said I needed 25 jigsaw pieces, and I've got 20. Oh, you live in all, but that's right. I did know that, Nummies. I'm sorry. That's my fault. I knew that. We're gonna check, we're gonna check all the levels and see where I can get jigsaw pieces from. I did. Son of a gun, I left that there. Because I was like, oh, I'll come back for that. No? Well, there's a freebie. Can I get up there? How do you get up there? Got a lurk. Thank you for the lurk. Good luck with the work. Okay, uh, I think I'm doing something wrong. Let's check this out and see... Did I watch the rest of development? Yeah, it's been a it's been a while, but yeah, I've watched all of it. Yo, I've left two pieces in here and one outside. That's three freebies, man. We can get these. And then I just need two more. The problem is I don't know. I don't remember. It's been so long. Wow. <laughs> Bob Loblaws Bob Loblaws Bob Loblaws Loblog. That's one of my favorites. I doubt I no 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 I know for a fact I didn't get all the Jinjos. I remember now because the first time I did it was in the the uh the treasure level and people were helping me and then I forgot like I didn't know what would happen when you got all the Jinjos, and then I left the level without getting the peas. <laughs> so I know I didn't get them all. Okay, so we can get the Jinjo piece. What else can we get? There's another piece somewhere in this level. Wasn't sure. 
Well, that was a freebie, was a reference or not? No, it wasn't. <laughs> You have a bottle opener. Alright, that's two gingos. Where is where do you guys think the last missing puzzle piece is? Somebody somebody quick go and watch my VOD from the first week. I know we did the monkey thing. I know we gave we got him an orange. Shut up. <laughs> We did this for sure. I can't see anything. I don't need to be collecting music notes. I had, what was it, like 96 or something. Oh, there's another Jinjo. Monkey. Oh, there's another one. Jeez. How did I not do this before? Where's the last one? Oh, that's right, you become an ant in this level. Okay, we, we did that whole thing. Where's the last puzzle piece? Oh, I never did this thing. I don't... I don't remember what this was. Wait, what is... Oh! Yo! <laughs> Not that that helps me, but that's probably what that is, right? That is what was in the title screen. <laughs> now that explains why I didn't get all the music notes. Oh my gosh. Go away. Yo, Jinjo. Let's go. Doop -doop -doop. Okay. Uh, so where is the last piece? Ooh, extra life. Ooh, no way. No way. Let's go. <laughs> Holy. <laughs> that was so easy. Do I need to be the ant to get the one that's outside? Is that how that works? Because I remember I could climb on, like, the weird surfaces. Stream marker that? <laughs> that was so easy! Yo, three free pieces? This stream might be shorter than we thought. I do, I know... At least I have a, an idea. I think we should go to the Haunted Mansion place for the puzzle pieces because I barely collected any. I just ignored them in that level. So I'm thinking that's probably going to be the easiest place for me to to get the remainder of the puzzle pieces that we need. Can I get up there? Uh. Ah! <laughs> oh, baby! I don't know what the last level is, though. I don't. 
We have 23. That was so fast. I went from 20 to 23, and it's we've only been streaming for, uh, I don't know, six, seven minutes. <laughs> Record short stream. <laughs> Good. <laughs> I'm tired of this game. <laughs> Wait, maybe I should, uh, should we save here? <laughs> Alright, I need to check other levels to see where we can get other puzzle pieces. Because that I don't know. <laughs> Always be saving. <laughs> Uh, where do I go? Where do you go? Oh no, I know for a fact I got all of them in the in the in the treasure place. Uh, what's in here? Always be cursing. Oh, this was this is just like where you. Oh, hi. Me, you. Show me what? Show me something in the little backpack. I don't know. Okay, this is just one of the pots that I used at the end of the game. I might come back and jump in there. What other levels did we not get puzzle pieces in? I don't even remember where all the levels are. Desert level. We... In here. Oh, boots. That's how you get to the desert level, right? What do you mean? Okay. What do we got in here? How many have we collected in this stage? Thanks for the what do you mean? Uh... Ten. Okay. So, <laughs> this is... this is no good. I can't get anything in here. I mean, maybe the, maybe the witch switch. I don't remember if I got that or not. I think I did in that level. I wish I had found more of those or access to more of them. Yo, Retro. Thank you for the good luck and good luck with your meeting. See you later, hopefully. Oh, maybe the, maybe the ice world. What? Oh, there was, actually, there was something in the ice world that I was like, oh, I'll come back to this later. Remember when I, like, soft-locked myself? Because, uh, I couldn't race that bear, the, the polar bear, because I didn't have the shoes. No co-worker today, let's go. Alright, so there's at least one in the, in the ice level, I think. It's all coming back to me, man. Hey, what's up, Air? How's it going? You're doing well today. Uh, wait, who did I raise? Is it the polar bear? Or is it walrus? Or I don't remember. Stream is in the Banjo speedrun Discord live streams. I, I'm not speedrunning. Was it? Did you tell me that the other week too? I know somebody mentioned that the other week. It might be because I have the speedrun tag on my stream because I do speedrun and I'm just too lazy to change my tags. So I was speedrunning yesterday, but not Banjo.
Hey, buddy. Fancy a race against Boggy? I certainly hope this is a puzzle piece here. Press A to accept. Okay. I accept. Okay, buddy. Here's the rules. Run through the red slalom gates and try to beat me to the end. Let's do it. Three, two, one. Go! Oh, now I'm fast. Now look what you've done. Well, hey! Well, hey! Well, hey! Can't see. Oh, he's catching up. No. No. Oh, I lost my shoes. Oh, man. He doesn't play fair. He knocked me in the water. How do I... How do I advance the conversation? <laughs> No fair. Cheater. Oh, I'm taking a lead. No, you cheater. You son of a gun. Is he slowing down? Thanks, man. That was nice of you. Did I win? Did I do it? I did it! Let's go. First try. Oh, just pretend that first one didn't happen. I lost again. Take my other medal. I'm off to look for my kids. Presents. I didn't already do that for you? I think I did that for you. Yay! We only need one more! First place. Ba -doop, ba -doop, ba -doop. We only need one more. Ooh, I need more golden feathers. Where's a where's like a really good place you can get golden feathers from? Yo, what's up, Ronnie? Thanks, man. I hope you're doing well today. It's good to see you. Uh, let's save there. I don't know where I where the last puzzle piece will be. Although I do have a hunch. I remember the last time we were in this level, I kept making comments about these snowmen. They all have X's on their heads. I feel like I'm supposed to take them out. Where's that platform I can fly from? Here it is. How do I do this again? It's not fair. No way! Yo! <laughs> I'm taking that! No, wait, stop. <laughs> stop rolling. <laughs> Is that the witch switch? I'm taking that. That's free. Where's that go? Oh, okay, how do we get that? I'm, okay, let's leave. How do I leave?
Also need to know where I can get like free golden feathers from. See, is this is where the puzzle piece is. Can't do anything. No, it's not there. Where is it? Oh, can I just... Oh. No, wait, that's not what I thought was going to happen. Oh, wait, do... Okay, so I smash this, and then I run out there, and then I'm able to fly from there to the puzzle piece. Maybe. Hopefully. Where is it? Is it here? What do you mean? Oh, I disagree. Go away. Where? Hang on, let me look at where the puzzle piece actually is. Oh, I think it's up there. Okay, yeah. I guess that's what I need to do here. I'm gonna have to watch a full speedrun, like a 100% speedrun of this once I'm done. Why is this snowman destroying me? Why does he have the best aim ever? It's possible to see. Oh, I got it. I didn't think I got it. Where is it? How high is it? Oh, is this it? <laughs> Nailed it. Let's go! I think that's all the puzzle pieces I need, at least from what I was told. I think I need 25. And I need 810 music notes, I believe. So, 16 more. Pretty confident that I can get from the haunted mansion place. Is that up here?
We got the new we got a new coffee maker the other day. It's a quick start manual with a bunch of recipes. Really? What kind of recipes? Oh, okay, good. We are in the right place. Mexican spiced coffee. What is it? what is in that? Alright, how many music notes do I have in here? Fifty. I only got half. So all I need is what? Sixty-six total. What do I have currently? I, I said I need sixteen, right? Cinnamon, chili powder, and cayenne. Oh, okay. It's exactly what I thought. I've heard of that with uh, hot chocolate. Uh, people people sell that a lot of the time in the winter here. Mexican hot chocolate, they call it. I've never tried it. Um, but it is it is fairly popular in the winter time here. All right, I need sixty six notes, and then I can I can leave. Maybe I'll just get like seventy to be safe. Why not just pour it straight into the toilet and eliminate the middleman? <laughs> Let us know how it goes. <laughs> Oh, I forgot how much I dislike this level. For me personally, it would go straight through. notes in here I really want just like a free thing of golden feathers go away how how is this level so bad <laughs> okay there goes that health there's the toilet <laughs> Yeah, there's some in here. Nice. To be honest, I did have a thought about throwing some ghost pepper flakes into my sun... Sun ripped? Tea? Sun ripped? Why is that a phrase I've never heard? Has spicy tea been done before? Ah, uh, probably, I'm sure. How do I get those? Not a big treat tea drinker. Speaking of tea, I should probably drink the tea I've got here. Oh, sun ripened. 
I probably should have been able to figure that out. <laughs> Dude, I'm so bad with that. I'm so bad with figuring out typos sometimes. I always sound so arrogant, but I don't... I genuinely don't know. I'm like, oh, I don't know what this is. <laughs> I always think it's something I've never heard of. I like tea, but I don't drink it much. What I have right now technically is not tea. It's just a concoction that I made for myself for the mornings. And it's just easier to call it tea. Uh, 29. This is a very, very, like, rareware song. I had to switch from coffee to tea. Coffee gives me anxiety. <laughs> and the mud butts. Um, I've never drank coffee. I, I have never liked coffee at all. Generally don't like iced tea. Hot tea is great, though. I almost exclusively drink hot tea. I'm really not much of an iced tea drinker. It's very rare. I'll enjoy it from time to time, but... Let's get out of your way. Is this just feathers in here? Go away, you... Skelly boy. Yo, hey, what's up, Jahaley? Good to see you, man. Hope you're doing well today. I like a nice iced green tea? I do too, occasionally from... Wawa has actually very, very good iced green tea, which is... It's not what you would expect, but it certainly does. <laughs> Wawa. Egg. 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 I'm looking for music notes. All I'm getting is eggs and feathers and destroyed. No, 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 no. Don't hurt me. I need help. I've never seen a Wawa. Um, I think they made their way over to your area. I'm not sure exactly how far they've expanded. It's It started local. It's a Philly thing. Wawa is a... A Philly thing that has since expanded very, very far. Go away. No, you know what? Uh, I'm not going in there. That's where the big, annoying green monster is. How do I, I don't remember how to defeat these guys. Not like this. No, dude. Go away. Who? Where? Can I get up there? How do we get up there? Are those flying foxes? Um, I think they're meant to be bats. The purple things. How do you get up there? I remember going up there before. Oh, is it from here? There we go. What do you mean? Flying fox is a type of bat? What do you mean? Let me up. Why is this so difficult? <laughs> Alright, we're halfway there. Looks like I have to wait two more years for Wawa, going off this article I just skimmed. Uh, Wawa used to be so much better, and then, then they got too big, and now they're just kind of like, I don't know, 7-Eleven. Ooh, 
more music notes. Um, Ronnie, where, if you don't mind, you don't have to say, but are you from, are you from, like, the sort of Philadelphia area, or where are you located? Oh, you're in Maine? I don't remember seeing any Wawa's when I was up in Maine. Circle K has gone downhill. I've been to a Circle K maybe once or twice. Any music news? No Wawa here, but every time we go down to PA. Oh, I see. It's Wawa in England. Gotcha. Yeah, they used to be really, really good. And then they started getting very, very large. And now they're not nearly as good as they used to be. Now it's just like gas station convenience store. Which is a bummer. Oh man, we're getting close, guys. Look! I broke my, pr I broke my record. We only need... 15 more notes. Can we do it? Oh, there's a few. I'm a cheesesteak hound dog, and they don't hit quite like they used to. The bread is... Yeah, they're, Wawa's bread... Wawa's got very good bread, because it's just your typical Philly bakery bread. Um... But to be quite honest with you, I didn't even know Wawa had cheesesteaks. I, I'm, I didn't even, I never ate red meat, and then I've, I've been about, I've been a vegetarian for around a year now, close to a year. So I would eat chicken cheesesteaks, but I wouldn't, I wouldn't have ever gotten one from Wawa even if I knew they had them, because it's not like, not like their thing. Oh wait, do I? I gotta be the pumpkin to come over here. I think I gotta be the pumpkin. Ah. Chicken cheese eggs are bomb. I mean, I used to eat them a lot. Before becoming a vegetarian. Um, would would recommend if anybody wants a good cheese steak in the area. Chicken cheese steaks are also very good. Japan ruined convenience stores for me stateside. I'm assuming they're very, very good and offer a lot and probably high tech as well. Can't see. Okay, 58. What do we need? 66? I said I'll get 70 to be safe, maybe. How do I get in the maze? I know there's there was like that hedge maze. Where is it? Generally, yes. Would you recommend going the veggie route? Um, I like being a vegetarian. For me, it was it was an ethic ethical choice. I love animals way too much to be eating them. <laughs> and like I said before, I even switched to being a vegetarian. I only ever ate um, poultry. It was only ever chicken. I never ate red meat or anything. But then I just felt like hypocritical and bad about eating chicken. I think chickens are adorable and fun and I shouldn't be eating them either so for me it was just like an ethics thing a personal personal choice whereas like I don't feel right about doing this oh there we go golden feather so I gave it up completely and I'm very happy about it um yes sometimes it's less convenient but these days uh there are so many vegetarian options so many when I when I first went vegetarian, I was a kid. I was 12, I think, 11 or 12 years old. And I actually, I couldn't sustain it because I'm such a picky eater that um, I wasn't able to get like my nutrients and protein from anywhere because of how I ate. And I got pretty sick. And um, there were no great options 
back then, but now, like, they make vegetarian versions of almost everything you could imagine. And it's it's much more convenient, much more, like, easily accessible and tasty. Yeah, way more options. So, for, you know, if you have the, uh, the will to do it, I think it, it can it can be done pretty easily without feeling like you're giving up too much. Can I get up there? Why am I blocked? Why does he just get blocked? What's that? But yeah, um, I don't mind it. I'm not vegan because my thought process with... Ooh, did I ever go in here? My thought process with being vegan is that a lot of foods that you eat... Ooh, I just hit the mark. I just hit the mark. A lot of foods that you eat uh, for for being a vegan um, are still part of like the natural life cycle, like chickens lay eggs. You just have to be careful of like mass production and, um, oh gosh, treating the, the animals ethically. Um, big farms and big production like that is usually bad. So if you can buy local, uh, that's much better and probably way better on the animals, so. Yo, what's up, Pat? You're vegan? How's it going, dude? Hope you're doing well. Okay, we hit the mark. We got what we need. How do I get out of here? You do it for selfish reasons? How could being a vegan be selfish? I will not give up my milk and cheese. So milk, I don't, I don't touch. Um, the milk industry is really bad. Milk, I don't touch. Cheese, cheese, I like. I enjoy cheese, and it's cheese is one of the more difficult things to avoid in general. You can obviously, but um, it is a little bit more difficult. And I like eggs and stuff. I'm spooky. Store brand pasta treats. What's up, Kraft? <laughs> Store brand pasta trees. Hope you're doing well today. Alright. Did I get everything I need here? I certainly hope so. I have 815. Let's not put a save state. <laughs> I have 815 and I have 20. You know what? Actually, I can put a save state on a second slot. Ah, now I'm using my brain. Uh, I did it because I accidentally found out I felt better without animal proteins. Like, my body was aching for years and I had no idea. So now I'm vegan. Well, there you go. That's I don't find that to be very selfish. I think that's a good idea. I was playing some games and didn't do half bad. So that's a literal win. Uh, what kind of games? This shirt makes me look like... I don't know. It makes me look funny. I don't... Don't look at me. Self-conscious. I slouch a lot, and I think I think my bad posture makes it look like I'm fat. <laughs> I'm a, my obsession with Dead by Daylight. I've heard of that. Heard of Dead by Daylight. Oh, by the way, I need to give you a follow still. What do you mean? I don't even think we were close to each other. Follow. There we go. Although it does feel good that I have eaten. I have eaten, I have not eaten an animal in over a year. Uh, it's like I used a cheat code and I'm breaking the rules. <laughs> Gex head. Um, yeah, I, I'm very happy with having gone vegetarian. It's been close to a year. Um, it was initially going to be my New Year's resolution, but I started super early. I think, I think in like July or August is when I started. So I'm coming up on a year. I don't care. Just change me. Staying alive in that game and escaping is a win. What is that game about? Dead by Daylight. Thanks, Pat. Congrats to you too, man. Animals, animals are too cool, man. You've been able to stick with it and it's been good for you? Yeah, so far so good. I probably don't eat as well, but that's honestly because of other factors, not because I've switched to being vegetarian. Um, 
It's more just my environment. Where can I get golden feathers? I need golden feathers. <laughs> I eat like crap. I, I kind of have not been eating that great. Leave me alone, leave me alone, leave me alone. <laughs> Honey badger. Well, that's a reference I haven't heard in a long time, Pat. <laughs> Feature made. It's a struggle some days. I just, I used to eat super healthy, and now, like, my, the, just, like, the general environment that I'm living in, um, it's a lot less convenient to eat healthy, and that stinks, because I like eating healthy. Um, but I almost feel like I'm kind of forced not to sometimes. And also, it's just so much tastier to eat unhealthy. Like, just being completely honest and transparent, it's just... Unhealthy things just taste better, that's what the whole purpose of them is, right? Uh, killers on one team for- oh, yeah, yeah, you guys did explain this to me. As soon as you said that, yeah, you're just- it, yeah, okay, I remember this. I just have no appetite. That's the other problem I have. I've never cared about nutrition. I've been trying to eat a little more because of my wife. A lot of people do not realize it's very easy to be vegetarian or vegan and eat unhealthy. For sure. Absolutely. People who only eat french fries. Yeah, like pizza. Um, if you're vegetarian, not if you're vegan, although you could still get vegan pizza. Um, but yeah, it's, it's very easy not to eat healthy as a vegetarian because you can just eat junk food and be like oh well i didn't eat meat <laughs> you know ah this is what i'm looking for okay realize that because it was my life for like 15 ish years Ooh, golden feather. okay this is not the pot that i was thinking it was There's another golden feather. How do I get that? I want as many golden feathers as possible. There's ten. So, what do I have? Seven? You son of a gun. golden feather below me. Yes. Alright, I need two more golden feathers. Do your research. Tell me where, where tell me where to get golden feathers, guys. That's already done. We already did all this. Uh, is this game still awful? Yes, but I think I have everything I need. And I think we're going to the end game here. But I don't really remember where to go. So that might be a problem. I've been eating healthier overall, but my portion control is Omega Lol. That's the other thing. Uh, when you when you go out to eat or order something to eat, you can't you can't control the portions they give you, and in America, it's just a joke how bad. Okay, so this is where I need to go. I need two more golden feathers. Where can I get them? Quickly. Where's, like, the best place I can get them? Uh, yeah, you can't control the portions that you get if you order something, and in America, it's just, like, a joke how, how they portion food here. Uh, I went to a new ramen place yesterday. It was pretty good. That's good. Godspeed to you. Thank you. I'm going to need it. 
My mom told me my bones would shatter in three months. Dude, I, I got those same speeches when I was, I, like I said, I was like 12 when I first went vegetarian. And um, I got all those speeches too. And then I was like guilt tripped. And also, like I said, I, it did it did take a toll on my health because I'm such a picky eater and there wasn't a ton of options. But I got all those like guilt trip speeches too. My mom was always worries about me as a kid because I didn't eat anything. I used to, and I still do. You guys still see me drink like those protein shakes. I, they're plant based, the ones I drink now. But I still drink those because I don't eat enough in general. Even took me to, to a nutritionist and they said I was fine. I should probably go to a nutritionist, <laughs> dietitian, something. Yep, me too, Ichi. Same thing. Same thing. Guys, where where can I get a golden feather? I need two golden feathers. Where can I? I need help. Somebody Google. I need really quick two golden feathers. I'm not willing to wander around for a half an hour. I got an extra life. I'm starving all the time. I don't get how people can just be like, oh, I'm not hungry. That's me, man. I'm, I have to force myself to eat. I used to, there was a few people who used to check up on me and be like, hey, have you eaten today? And that was always like super nice. It's really nice that people uh, would do that. I don't really have anybody that does that anymore, but not that anybody should have to. Obviously I'm an adult and it's like my, my own decisions, but that always felt nice. Like somebody concerned about my well-being. Protein is based on 200 pound people. Your iron is based on 170 pound people. I don't weigh either of those. <laughs> I weigh much less than that. Do either of you track your calories or macros? No, do not. Um, that can actually be dangerous mentally. Doing that can actually take a toll on your, on your mental well-being. I don't recommend it. Uh, most nutritionists will not recommend it. Um, you can, but it's, you have to be careful with it. Guys, golden, somebody Google golden feathers. I need to find two golden feathers. I'm struggling. Where can I go? What about this way? I don't care about nutrition for myself. I I care. I'm just I just don't I don't know, I've kind of fallen off the wagon in terms of in terms of like taking really good care of myself. Um food wise. Oh, there's one. Is there another? I get a second one down here. Hello? Is there any more? Uh, Google says there's a giant gold feather in the last room before the last boss. Oh, I'm... No, 864 notes. I ain't doing that. <laughs> I just need a small one. Like an easily accessible small one. It's not something I think about, like, ever. I think about it. But I don't follow. I don't follow it. I used to be really good with it, with nutrition in general, but things change and it's easy to fall, fall off um, your sort of routine and habits. Listen to my body, but I loosely track the calories and macros, not strictly. I just do it to make sure I'm getting 
some calcium and other things that are hard to get as a vegan. That's why I think I need to see a nutritionist slash dietitian to, to like find out what the best practices are in terms of getting the nutrients that I actually need. I definitely don't do that. What do you mean? No! Oh, I wasted one! What do you mean? Oh. Thanks, nummies. You guys have been slacking on the what do you mean today. If there's something I want to eat, I eat it. If I don't, I don't. I just want to be healthier in general. Do golden feathers like respawn in stages? Like, could I go back in? Ooh. You go to the doctor once a year to get blood work. It's a good way to get an idea of where you are. Um, yes, I do. Um, but I've I've also had to get blood work a lot more than that because of uh, kidney issues. Um. Guys, where do I get golden feathers? Do you think is that you uh, is what you're doing? Oh, listening to your body and eating when you're hungry. Sister has some kidney issues. It is not fun. Oh, there's a golden feather. Um, I wish the best to your sister because it's really a pain to have to deal with. Literally and figuratively. I need one more golden feather, guys. Hashtag we buy gold feathers. No, let me live. Oh, there's one. How do I get that? Without dying. Actually, does it matter? <laughs> fine. Everything's fine. Let's leave. Uh, I'm actually going to put a save state. Get out of here. Level feels pretty chill. This is actually one of the least chill levels that I had to do. It was very annoying. <laughs> it's nice to look at. Had I have some bad news. I haven't been able to do. I haven't been able to create any of my short form videos, and I don't know if I'm going to be able to get any out this weekend. The program I use to do it has been failing every time I try to render a video. It's really frustrating. I'm annoyed. Where do you take me? What do I use? A program called Streamladder. I think that's what it's called. Ha 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 
Oh, this took... This, what? No, I don't want to be here. Wait, actually... Actually, no, this is not bad. Uh, I can go... Somewhere. Dude, <laughs> I don't know where I'm going in this game. <laughs> Your videos are a vehicle for my bad sense of humor. That's what reminded me. <laughs> because of the puns. Because <laughs> you always leave, like, a comment of some type of pun. <laughs> Bro, where did you come from? Go away. Let me live my life. Can I, please? Oh no, the puns. <laughs> Exclamation dad joke. Oh look, I could have just apparently gotten another gold feather here. Neat. I love this game. I guess they just respawn. Alright, guys. I really wish I had moments to give you guys, so that when this is over, I could give you a moment for having to endure this monstrosity of a game that I can't play because I'm bad. No! I don't have to do this again, do I? Can I just go through? I'm going to be so upset. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> I would have been so mad. <laughs> As you climb this tree, you're leaving. <clears throat> you have moments, Health? Why is Twitch so weird? Like, why do they pick and choose who's deserving of certain features? I didn't know you had moments. <laughs> Ooh, -ooh. Moments are weird. I like them. I think they're like a neat little... Neat little badge of support. There's a one-up over here. Since the camera is so good, I can't see it. The camera is awesome. <laughs> you are unallowed to see this. There we go. Go uh -huh. Let's go! Pog! Was this the last one? Ooh, baby! Is it almost over? I don't know, I don't know what the witch said because I, I, I ain't paying attention to her little spiel. Safe here at the top. Uh... Ooh, what's in here? Let's... Let's save. Um... Never use them, never remember they exist. I don't understand the point. Uh, it's just kind of like a, a badge of support, just to, like, show that you were there during an, a, an important event. I, th I think it's really good for speedrunners in particular, because if you PB or something, you can give out the moments badge to the people who were who were there, and I think that's really cool. But you could do it for other things, like like I said, if I beat this godforsaken game that I've been playing for so long and I hate, <laughs> and I've gone from uh, from happy to sad the whole time <laughs> while playing this game. Once it's finished, I could be like, I could give you guys the moments badge, and then you would have that to show off on the channel, and then the people who weren't here wouldn't have it. And they could be jealous of you. I think it's cool. I think it's just like a neat little badge of support. I think that's one good thing Twitch did, but they didn't give it to everyone, so it's kind of silly. How do you know if you have them? Um, you just have to check your your Twitch uh, your Twitch channel. Like if I were to type in slash moment, nothing would come up. Yeah, just nothing that comes up. And there's a, there's a button you could add to. <laughs> Ooh. 
I like ladies, I'm not attracted to bears. I would win this game by letting Grunty win. <laughs> I was here for the moment when health had moments <laughs> and Mitri didn't. <laughs> Thank Gecko. Yeah, it's just an I was there badge, which I think is cool. I like that. After I mow the lawn, I will dance like Banjo. Got a moment in a stream I raided. I got raided to while lurking. That's what's weird to me because the whole point about moments is that, excuse me, is that you're supposed to manually claim them. Shut up. <laughs> you're supposed to manually claim them, but apparently that's one thing Twitch has failed is that like you can just be lurking in a stream and then still get them. It's kind of weird. Um, you're supposed to to manually say like I was here and claim that badge, which I think makes more sense. So, I don't know, maybe they're working on fixing that, maybe not. Imagine being named after an object you own. The bear that plays the banjo is named Banjo. Stalling, I started calling Mitri sunglasses. I don't know if that would offend me or not. <laughs> so these are optional? Is that... These are optional doors? I don't need to to deal with these. You found some notes, but you need more to break my spell past this door. Dude, what a disgusting smell. Ooh, visitors for ding pot. I like visitors. No wonder you get any sewer breath. Ah, what does strange birdie thing mean? Well, she said that we're looking for Gruntilda. Do you know where she is? Sure do, Mr. Bear. Grunty's awful. You know, she was sick in me earlier on. Gross. If you can get rid of her, I'll be free. But she's in, in the pot. Don't be sure, you silly pot. Soon I'll have you nice and hot. See these filthy clothes I've got? When I've won, you'll wash a lot. What? Don't worry, Dingpot. We'll sort her out if you can find us a way up there. No problem, just splosh on in and I'll fire you up to the top. Jump in there? No way, Dungbox. How long is this conversation? Come on, Kazooie, you get a chance to peck the witch's butt. Let's go. Still going. If you think I'm rather soft, I'll be waiting in the loft. Is it done? All right. I think we can just jump in. Those are all option of good. Okay. I remember watching Fasta last summer. Fasta, Fasta, Fasta. It's, is it still going? Everyone got the moment notification and everyone was like, what's this? Very personal injury. <laughs> So, like, excited to happy to just kind of indifferent to mad to sad to smadge. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty much been my progression through this game. <laughs> I started off, my brother and I were talking about this, I started off really liking it because when you start off, it's kind of like, uh, it's kind of like a gotcha. That first level is super easy. And, and of course, like, yeah, the tutorial level is going to be easy and the rest of it's not. But it go the... The difficulty increases exponentially, and the fact that you need, like, 94% of everything in the game just to complete it, when in, like, su something like Super Mario 64, you can literally get almost 50%, like, 70 of 120 stars, and you can still beat the game. Like, I expected Banjo-Kazooie to be more like that. Yeah, massive required collect collect-a-thon, exactly. That's what I didn't really enjoy about it, especially when you die, you lose everything. That was, that's the toughest thing. I feel like Clanker is where the difficulty spike happens. I liked Clanker himself, but the stage, yes, was very difficult. I will be right back, and then I guess we'll take on, hopefully, the final boss here. Hang tight, guys. Bear with me, product idea. Anyone who subs for 60 months gets a pair of Mitri sunglasses. 
with his logos. We can call them subclasses. <laughs> Only three years to go. 33 more months. No toilet in this room. Thanks for the welcome back. All right. Oh, it went dark. Okay. They're still talking. I'm just, let's go. This is going to be hard, isn't it? It's going to be really hard. Especially since I don't remember the controls. Gotta go walk the dog. Thanks for the good luck, Ichi. Enjoy walking your dog. Had a GF, but Grunty broke her handle. I, I missed everything she just said. Uh, can't see anything. Ah! Turn! What are you... Ah! Oh, uh... What is she doing? Oh! Can I? Oh, I can! Did that work? I don't know what she said. <laughs> this text! <laughs> the text in this game is super annoying. Where is she? Ah! Can I peck her? Did that work? I don't know if that worked. Ah! Uh... No! I Turn! I can't see anything, dude! <laughs> this game! I don't know if that's working or not. I don't know if I'm hurting her. It's this camera! It's gonna get me killed! Magic spell to seek out your prey is sure to hit. Uh oh, what's happening? What's happening? No! I don't I don't know what she says. It happens so fast. I can't read the text and avoid all her attacks. Bro! <laughs> What is that? I can't do anything, man. Did it work? Am I winning? Am I am I doing good? Is this good? I'm almost dead. There's no health drops or anything? I don't know if this is good or not. I have no, no way to gauge what is happening. Bye. Goodbye. All right, we, we tried. Yo, what's up, Ashley? How are you doing? How is the game? Confusing and tough. <laughs> How are you doing today? I'm hanging in there. Thank you for asking. She's not saying anything important. Okay, good. All right, we'll try again. I don't know if I was doing good or not. It's very frantic. The fight is six phases? How come you don't get, like, health drops or anything? Like, I feel like that's kind of essential. Am 
I'm good. It's the last day of my week. Oh, my last day of my week off. I was like, isn't last day of the week a good thing? But yeah, if it's the week off, then yeah, that's <laughs> that's less good. I'm glad you're doing well. I hope I hope you've enjoyed your time off. Goodness me. Oh my goodness me. Alright, I'll leave that health drop there. Alright, where does she go? This is... Okay. The wash. You know what? How many... Wait, do I still... Hang on. Hmm. We'll see. This isn't a game for babies. <laughs> Oh no. My baby. Gosh. How do you avoid her attacks while hitting her? Am I good? Wait, am I am I getting good? Am I getting better at this game? gaming? I'm gonna run out of eggs. Oh, not that thing again! How do you avoid that? Oh, maybe I need to use the, the golden feather. What is this? What did he say? Do I... No! Where am I going? Can you get struck by the lightning? No way, dude! No way. Alright, we'll go back to when I first entered. So at least I'm full on eggs and stuff. All right, that's annoying. Any tips? Uh, yeah, feel free. God, this is so long. Green stuff is countered with gold feathers. All right, I forget how to gold feather. <laughs> And you got the... Son of a gun. First two phases down. Okay. How did that hit? So wait, how do I golden feather? Okay. Okay. Alright, you know what? I'll try to do it all in Oh, I should have... Oh, shoot. I should have made a third slot there. I'll try to do it all in one shot, but we'll see. No! Where am I? That's lame. Okay. 
Hey, thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate that. You're doing well. Wait, am I actually good? Disregard that. Uh, oh, baby. <laughs> Not bad so far. Now use your aerial skills against the old buzzard. Okay. Dude, I don't... The flying physics. I don't understand. Why? Why do you have a death wish? The anything physics true. Good point. Bro. Leave me alone. Yo, what's up, Jedi? Good to see you, man. You're doing well. How does that not hit? How does that not hit? How many hits does this take? That's the next question. No. I'm running out of feathers. I know there's a couple down there on the ground, but... Flying physics might be worse than swimming physics, honestly. Did that hit? I don't know if that hit or not. That pointy beak did not miss, but now let's see get through this. Uh, I, I guess I, I guess I did that phase. I'm doing pretty good. Glad to hear. Kanjo Bazooey boss. What do I do? Oh, hello. Nice bear and bird save the gingers from the witch. What? Say little furry friends come here to share your bitter end. Okay. So they're help? They're they're they are helping me? Alright. So I don't have to sit through that again. Kinda of getting bored being writing for like three weeks, be smoke and fire, I guess. But I haven't been working much. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, man. Hope, uh... No? Oh, there we go. I'm a genius. I hope that it gets better soon. Dead high. We're, we're getting the wildfire smoke right now. Ah! Am I a genius? Am I good at this game? When did that happen? All the Jinjos were on my side the whole time. What happens if you don't save the Jinjos? Is there a fifth one? No? Uh, I bet you thought you could beat me. 
But look, I've landed on my feet. Is it, what? Is that what she said? Uh-oh. <laughs> what a time. What a time to pause. Hey, I've been good since... Since I fell that one time. Uh... I am the mighty Gingenator? <laughs> what did it say? Activate something? <laughs> oh, <laughs> this is incredible. <laughs> oh, I can't see those things. I guess I gotta listen for the for the sound. That's closed. I'm getting I'm getting destroyed. Oh, no, guys, no! I was doing so well. I was doing so well until that point. Oh, I was so close to doing it. Even though I put the save states. I was so close to doing it without. This is rough, dude! You have no time to shoot. Okay, that's closed. Does this side not have one? What are you doing? What are you doing, Banjo? <laughs> Dude, this is this is ridiculous. What is this? It should be the last phase. Oh my gosh. How many phases does this witch have? <laughs> Too many. <laughs> Pretty much par for the course in this area. I live on the east east coast of Canada. Gotcha. I do hear it's gosh, very rainy. Oh my lord. Are you kidding? Stop! <laughs> this is nuts! No, not create. This is absolutely crazy. Stop. This is, I can't, I can't tell you how nuts this is. I can't move without getting hit. My god. This is absolutely insane. What a horrible idea. To this day I've still not beaten this boss. I'd always kick my butt as a kid. I can see why. You can't move in this phase without getting hit. This is crazy. You don't get any health drops, man! How is this fair? Katie Rattel Business. Yo, Pickle, thanks for the... several months? I don't know how many. I'm already down to two. One. It's it's shooting where I'm going to be. Like this is so this is so ridiculous. Uh thank you for the 17 months, pickle. 
I won't now out of sheer principle. I don't blame you. You have a casual method for it. Avoid all the fire, block the green thing, shoot eggs and repeat. Can you ride Kazooie? Or go left, right, left, right? I feel like everything I do is is just hitting me no matter what I like where no matter where I go in this stage, it's just killing me. It doesn't help when the controls don't work. Like, look, I'm going that way, and it shoots where I'm going to be. This must... This might be the most frustrating boss I think I've ever... Like, I can't... I can't imagine doing this without save states. Half my health gone. Of course it misses. Is that not done yet? It still hits when you're running away. <laughs> what are you supposed to do, man? That went very well. <laughs> I don't care anymore. I just want to be done with this. Go. Go, Jinjo. Run! What are you doing? Go! What are you doing? Is there a hole on the other side that I can't see? There is? Oh, it's really good that they hit it there so you can't see it at all. <laughs> oh my lord. You've called them Jinjo for the last time. There's no way he'll shift my bulk. I watch you cry and have a soul. I'm glad I made my go live notification Jinjo today. <laughs> I was not expecting this. <laughs> oh man. What is this? Is that it? That was... The first several phases were okay. I could do those. That last phase is crazy. And you don't get any health drops. Freddy's face should, should not be so hurry. I don't even know what you said. It, the, the text goes so fast, you can't read it. 
And then it does it while you're playing as well, and you can't read any of that. These are the GGs. This was a game. Jinjo! I have a new new respect for Jinjos. This is the real last phase. Get Jinjoned. Of course, uh, Rare needs to put a sexy polygonal woman carrying two watermelons in front of her chest. Because, because Rare. Ah, this is great. Have we finished now, Duty? Can I relax? Sure, Banjo. You and Kazooie are heroes now. And it only took 18 safe states. Did you hear that, Shorty? I'm a hero. 18 safe states on the last phase, I mean. Hmm, yes, I suppose you are. Well done, Kazooie. Thanks, Goggles. You're not so dumb after all. That's enough, Kazooie. Let's all watch the cast list now. The cast list? Oh. The credits. Didn't we do this already? Didn't we see? <laughs> Video game racism is over. Am I done? Is it for it's is it done for real? Flash moment, you were here. You are actually done. Oh, thank goodness. I don't know how children beat this game. <laughs> I don't know. On original N64 hardware. Holy. Uh, big props to anybody who beat this game when it came out. Or anybody who has beat it not on the Xbox version. Or not using save states because this was tough. Seriously, this was tough. Thanks, Craft. If you collect all the notes and puzzle pieces, you can get bonuses like double health. Really? Thanks, Gecko, for the GGs. Wow, that was a game. So, I... I think had I played maybe the Xbox version, uh, where you don't lose everything every time you die, I think that would have made it a lot more manageable and a lot more friendly. Um, I do think that last phase is crazy hard. I'm sure if I practiced it, I would be able to do it. But honestly, the first few phases of The Witch weren't that bad. Um, I think I would be able to go back and like one-shot all of those. But that last phase is pretty pretty difficult. There's also cheats, but if you use three, your save gets erased on N64, really? I completely forgot about the quarterly life stuff, but that was only in the 360 version. Yeah, that's what everybody was telling me when we were when we were going through this. Um and that sounds so much more manageable. And again, like just big props to anybody who beat this game. In the early days, man, took the time and and really just did everything they needed to do without without hamming it up like I had to. This is a tough game. Soggy. Um. I don't know. Again, I think if it were a little bit more like Mario 64, which is the impression that I got when I first started playing. I think if you didn't need like 90 plus percent of any everything in the game, I think that in combination with the the quality of life improvements from 360 where you don't lose everything if you die, I think like those two things together would make this a much more fun game. And then a lot of that becomes optional. A lot of that other stuff just becomes, oh, this is what I want to do. I want to go back and collect everything and try to 100% uh, the game. Which is something I typically do. I like 100% in games, but this this doesn't appeal to me um, as a 100% game after what I've, ex <laughs> what I've experienced. So Tui next. 
Probably not. <laughs> Probably not. Oh no, I missed the name of the uh, the ice block enemy. What was it? Clinker? Tui is substantially better. I've heard... I have heard that it's worse. <laughs> I guess it depends on the person. But I've heard that it's harder. Nibbly. Maybe we'll take a look at it someday, Jedi. Hudson. This feels very unnecessary. I don't... <laughs> this is like Mega Man 2 Game Boy credits. Where it's just six minutes of telling you every enemy you ever saw in the game. And I just don't care. <laughs> SMW credits. Yeah, that's another one. Five, five minutes worth of enemies. But at least they also put in the, the credits of the... You know the people that produce the game, unlike Mega Man 2. Except SMW is life, right? Alright, and we're back on the beach with the woman in the melons. Oh, it's Mumbo. Hey, Mumbo got secret pictures. Nice one, Bone Brain. What's on them? I don't like where this is going. Got pictures of things you missed. Oh, okay. Secrets used in next next game. Oh, did you hear that, Kazooie? We're going to be in another game. That's very meta. Great. So let's see the pictures in Skirt Boy. Skirt Boy. He's not wearing anything. Do you get all 100 jigsaw pieces? No. And I absolutely am not going to. Uh, I don't think so. We only got 94 of them. That's what I was told I needed. Only best players see pictures. Get 100 pieces and Mumbo show you. That's not fair. Can't we just have a quick peek? No. Mumbo, go now. Got hot date. Perhaps you haven't finished after all. Yes, I have. Yep, I absolutely have. <laughs> nope. I'm not going to look for missing pieces, Tootie, or whatever your name is. Yeah, I want to see those pictures. Well, that stinks. Uh, Google them. Because you're not seeing them on this stream. Ooh, Klungo push, nasty rock. Don't worry, mistress. I'll save you. Stupid bear and dumb Kazooie. I'll be back for Banjo-Tooie. They knew! They knew! Veend. Veend. We did it! You were here! Yay! I get to put this game away forever. Holy! I'm done. I am done playing Banjo-Kazooie. Oh boy. Thank you all for, uh, everybody who helped, first of all. I had a lot of people come in and help me during this. Yo, Gecko, thank you so much for the hundred. <laughs> GG, this one is done. Wow, wow, wow. <laughs> thank you very much, Gecko. Thank you, Nummies, for the GG. Uh, thank you for everybody who... Ooh, good luck with your session. Everybody who came in and helped me, because there was a lot of people who came in and offered tips and stuff. Uh, thank you for everybody just for watching, um, because this was kind of a slog for me. And thank you just for all of your support. This was... Uh, this was... a little worse than I expected it to be. <laughs> 
Yo, silly ear mosquito. Thank you so much for the raid. I appreciate it. Howdy, howdy. How are you doing? Hope you're doing well today. Uh, yeah, thanks, everybody. That was, that was an, an adventure for sure. Uh, thank you, Caddy, for the GGs. I appreciate it. Thank you, guys. Hope you all have a wonderful rest of your morning, afternoon, evening, or night, whatever time it is, wherever you may be. Take care. Have a wonderful weekend. I will see you next week with all kinds of fun stuff. And uh, I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for being here. Thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging, playing, everything. Uh, take care, everybody. See you next time. Bye!